hello friends welcome back to another video tutorial in vray 6 for revit i am architect sonorai from glad studio and in this studio video tutorial i am going to show you how to render a basic interior scene in revit so you can see this is a interior scene of revit and i have uh, put some uh, ceiling lights and wall lights to just to understand the basic uh, functioning of V-Ray interior so uh, I'm going to my V-Ray and then you can see uh, I have selected this current view is 3D view 3 which is our interior scene and uh, I will select render production here and you can also click on this uh, frame over here and now the quality I am putting it low and resolution you can uh, keep it any wide screen or it is to 5 screen and you can s select the pixels value here because we are trying here so you can keep it low to save the render timing and when you get uh, finalized about your scene you can use a higher resolution here so I am keeping this artificial lights off and I am selecting here V-Ray Sun so you can see here this is our variation and you can use this for lighting your scene so you can see uh, our sun setting here sun path you can um, turn it on and you can use this uh, a specified project location and you can see this is our project location by default and you can also uh, turn the shadow on here and now we'll uh, use our uh, rendering here so i'm going to select variation artificial lights off resolution is low quality low and now i'm going to use render production so we'll see how it's going to work so you can see this is our uh, rendering of scene rendering is completed and this is very dark so uh, because uh, there is very few lights and sun light is not as per our project uh, settings so I'm going to send settings and I'm going to select any location here so, so I'm based in India so I'm going to select New Delhi here and India and we'll search here so this is our New Delhi click ok ok and now we can do some settings here so i'm going to select any timing here so um, i'm going to select any date here or date and now i'm going to select pm so 1 pm which is a uh, summer so we can use this and you can also use any summer solace so i'm going to select and i'm going to create a summer scene so this is our settings for sun and now i'm going to render again now you can see this is a little bit brighter but again uh, the window size is uh, small so you can see the light is not coming and you can see this is low quality render is completed so now i am going to uh, ex uh, increase the exposure value here so i am going to click on this exposure value and it will bring this towards sun sign here and now i am keeping it a bright interior you can see this is changing to bright interior this value is 8 and now I again i am going to use render production here and now we'll see our scene so you can see uh, this scene is much more improved here and you can see um, some lightings is turned off and some are uh, getting lighted uh, after our artificial light is off also then also this is uh, creating in our interior scene because I have turned the artificial lights off then also you can see this surface lighting and ceiling lighting is getting brightened up 
and it's showing lights so i will tell you what is the reason you can see this is rendering and this is uh, more improved now after you can increase this exposure value of sun so now i'm going to close this and i will tell you what is the reason of this uh, illumination of lighting even after this uh, our uh, artificial light is off so you can check it here and go to edit type of uh, and you can see the material here and see this glass material so we can click on this three dot and we'll see what is the material on the glass and you can see this is auto illumination light is all uh, selected here this is material if you change the material to any basic glass this will uh, not illuminate so i am keeping it uh, default only and now again i am going to uh, uh, select dome light here so i am going to select dome light and you can select a dome light intensity you can select any hdr image here and uh, this hdr image is not uh, displayed right now and you can use your own custom and you can select revert default also and now again i'm going to use render production with dome light and now we'll see this is our dome light here and you can see the difference now and with the help of dome light you can use and can i'm going to cancel this and now i'm going to use custom here and can select your own uh, sdr image so i'm going to select this sdr image here so this is all you can download any sdr image and now we can again render this with the render production and you can find a little bit difference here so this is with the different hdri image so you can see uh, this wall light is not uh, lighting because we have turned off artificial light lighting and this is using auto illumination from rabbit material so that's why it's getting lighting up so now you can see this wall light is not lighting so because uh, artificial light is turned off and it's of not auto illumination uh, material so i'm going to turn this artificial lights on and now with this uh, dome light i'm going to again use a render production here and you can see our artificial light shades turn on and you can see this wall light is lighting now with the help of dome light and you can see this scene is more improved and it's taking more rendering time and so when you will finalize this scene and you give time this rendering will improve more so i'm uh, waiting to get it uh, rendered so this is 52 percent and you can see your scene is more improved now and after this uh, i'm going to cancel this and i'm going to use no light here and background you can keep any background and you can select none also and now again i'm going to render with artificial lights on and there is no light here so we'll see what is the difference so you can see uh, this is completely interior no uh, light from outwards so this is interior scene and you can see this is also coming nice here and now i am going to close this and we'll keep this variation and you can keep the quality to medium and 
can use or render production here and you can now see the difference here so this is very sun and artificial lights also is also on and you can see I have kept this quality medium and you can see your rendering scene is more improved so likewise you can do this basic settings of interior scenes in Revit and when we will go to our material and appearance manager we will learn more settings here so this is the tutorial for the today's session in the next session I will come with some more rendering settings in VDA for Revit so thanks for watching please like share and subscribe my channel bye bye